So we've got a 30 horsepower engine, which at the transmission is probably only delivering 25 to 27 horsepower. And then we're hitting it with a load, potentially, that's 25-30% uh, of its rated output. Hello and welcome to another one of our Ask the Expert sessions here at Boat How To. I'm Jan Attenstedt and we're talking to Nigel Calder. Hi. And today we have a question about high output alternators, one of Nigel's specialties. My question is, my 30 horsepower diesel used to run to its full rated 3600 RPM. I recently replaced the stock alternator with a high output alternator with an external voltage regulator. Ever since, sometimes I can get up to 3600 RPMs and sometimes I am below this. I feel sure the two things are related, but can't see how. Do you have any ideas? I do. <laughs> so, so Jan, was that a 30 or a 40 horsepower engine? Uh, 30 horsepower. 30, so that's a pretty small engine. Let's say for argument's sake, that's a 100 amp alternator and it's probably only 50 to 60% efficient. So it's actually the equivalent of a 200 amp load on the back. Uh, and if we translate that into horsepower, it's probably somewhere between five and seven horsepower. And if the alternator is even more powerful, it's going to be higher, maybe 10 horsepower. So we've got a 30 horsepower engine, which at the transmission is probably only delivering 25 to 27 horsepower. And then we're hitting it with a load, potentially, that's uh, 25, 30% of its rated output. I think what's going on here is that at times the battery bank is well discharged. So then the alternator goes to full output and that added load on the engine prevents the engine from getting to its full RPM. And then other times the batteries are well charged, so the alternator output is fairly low, so then the engine can get to its full RPM. Uh, the fix for this never used to be available, but we do have it today. It's a controller, an alternator controller, that ramps down the alternator's output as the engine gets closer to wide open throttle. And we've got these kind of controllers in the marketplace now with the integral system which I helped to develop for standalone alternators such as this with an external regulator. We've got three companies now. We've got Wakespeed, who's been in this business the longest. We've got um, the Zeus regulator that comes from Arco, which was released uh, earlier this year. And we have a brand new one from a company called Revitech, the Altium controller. And all three of these, the Wakespeed, the Zeus and the Altium, uh, can be programmed where they will shut down the alternator output as we get close to wide open throttle and that'll fix the problem. Well, that's good information. And also in general, I mean, if you don't run at full RPM, it's actually really good to have that extra load, right? It increases the engine. It efficiency. improves the engine efficiency and you end up getting your electrical energy generated probably more efficiently than you can get it out of a standalone generator. Well, thanks for your take on that, Nigel. If you want to learn more about alternators, generators, diesel engine, we have a bunch of info about all of this in our courses, both the electrical courses, especially the advanced marine electrics course, but also our brand new marine diesel engine maintenance course. So make sure to check that out at boathowto.com. See you soon.